Celebrities' sad reactions to Lil Durk passing away. It's some backwoods. Yeah, what kind? Uh, what kind you got? Original stout cream. This is rush cream. In breaking news, it has just been confirmed that Lil Durk is no longer with us. Lil Durk, whose government name was Dirk Derek Banks, is currently being mourned by fans all over the world. Lil Durk was a pioneer in Chicago's rap scene and is widely considered to be one of the forefathers of Chicago drill rap, along with his good friend and partner Chief Keef. Both fans and artists alike have been at a total loss since his unexpected passing, as it appears that Dirk's street drama unfortunately caught up to him. Lil Durk was out in public in Atlanta, Georgia when the accident happened, as the star now owns a home out there with his family. Lil Durk, often referred as Durkio, was parked on the side of the road. Apparently, another car pulled up next to Lil Durk and the car was full of members of an opposing gang. They seem to have been targeting the OTF rapper as they opened fire on him while he was still waiting for the light to turn green at the intersection. Witnesses report that it happened in an instant and that the attackers were gone in a flash. By the time responders arrived to help Lil Durk, he had already passed on. Now, celebrities all over the world are giving shout outs to Lil Durk and reacting to the news as they praise the late Chicago superstar. Welcome to Lime Report. Today, we'll be telling you everything you need to know about this situation one detail at a time, so be sure to pay close attention. Before we get into this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment keyword Shy Town for a chance of winning our giveaway. Now, back to the video. Lil Durk was no stranger to violence or street crimes, as Durk was a famous rapper, but more so a notorious Chicago street gangster. He had been involved in many illegal and very dangerous situations before, though these days he had taken a much more hands-off approach to handling his affairs. The star was being praised for turning a new leaf in the last year, as after another bad situation he had sworn to focus more on music and his family, while leaving everything else on the sidelines. Due to this, investigators and fans alike are unable to tell if this was an act of organized crime between gangs or simply a random act of street violence against a celebrity. Stars like Chief Keef, who was one of Durkio's best friends, and other major stars like Drake have all given their input on the situation. On Twitter, Drake said, Lil Durk was a true artist. I really enjoyed working with him in the brief moments that we got to. I had a lot of fun shooting the music video for Laugh Now Cry Later. It was actually one of the funnest times I have ever had working with another artist. You will be missed, Dirk. Rest in peace. Drake's tweet has since gone viral, as Dirk is already trending on Twitter. Drake's condolences had a lot of engagement from fans of Dirk, who praised Dirk for his kind words. Drake is a massive star who doesn't often take time out of his day to tweet, so fans of Lil Durk seem to really appreciate this gesture, as do most kind-hearted people online in general. Chief Keef, on the other hand, took a completely different kind of approach to giving his input on this tragic news. He first made a tweet where he called out whoever took Lil Durk's life, saying, Y'all took my boy Durk, so I'm gonna have to come out of retirement now and make it right. He then began to tweet directly at Lil Durk's account, repeatedly expressing his love for his old friend. In one of the tweets, Chief Keef says to Lil Durk, Glory boys and only the family are gonna be at the top no matter what. GBE and OTF together forever. OTF, which stands for Only the Family, is the group that Lil Durk formed without Chief Keef after they both splintered off from their original crew. Before, Chief Keef was butting heads with Lil Durk as the two were sneak dissing each other despite being childhood friends. Due to this, there were also many times before where Chief Keef had tweeted out against OTF. Although he always took these comments back later when they would rekindle his friendship with Durkio. Now that Durk is gone, Chief Keef is really hammering on the fact that he did have much love for Durkio despite any past drama. Longtime fans of Lil Durk also tend to be longtime fans of Chief Keef, and most Chief Keef fans know that the artist is not kidding about any of the stuff that he talks about in his music or online. Keef is known for getting caught up in some serious crimes, though he always manages to get out of real trouble. Now, many fans of Lil Durk are expressing via Twitter that they believe Chief Keef may know who it is that targeted Lil Durk. Although it happened in Atlanta, 
Keefe's reach is very far, and so the star might actually go after Lil Durk's enemies. It remains to be seen if Chief Keefe is actually willing to go that far for his old friend, or if he's just caught up in anger due to the heat of the moment and the impact of the bad news on him. Many of Keefe's fans apparently believe that Chief Keefe is just mourning the loss and that he is making empty threats to an unknown group as his own way of coping with the loss. That's all for this video. Thanks for sticking to the end. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment keyword Shytown for a chance of winning our giveaway. See you next time on Lime Report.